Hello, my name is Sharon Arrington, and I'm a student here at Holy Spirit. My class recently had an assignment where we had to compare our lives to the lives of pilgrim children. In rare form, I informed my parents about this assignment, and of course they had to give me their take on it, like I asked. You would think that they came over here on the Mayflower. They're always reminding me of how easy I have it. My dad says, when I was 10, I walked two miles to school, had two, two jobs, and cooked dinner every night. Oh, really? Saying the still on in my house is like a UFO sighting. I just stand there and stare at all the pretty lights. <laughs> different story with these people, from having to go to school when it snowed, mowing the lawn, and working in the garden. Who are they fooling? My parents never step foot out of the house when it snows. The lawn guy comes by twice a month. <laughs> the lawn guy comes by twice a month, and my mom can't even tell a, head of a cabbage from a head of lettuce. <laughs> my favorite story is my dad's philosophy on time out. He doesn't believe in it because he thinks it's a chance for kids to sit and plot their next move, which might have some truth to it, especially when me and my sister get in fights. I have a 23-year-old sister. Yeah, I know. I sometimes wonder about the large age difference myself. <laughs> My parents had to wait that long for God to approve their application for another child. What is their spiritual credit score? <laughs> Anywho, when my sister's yelling at me, I'm listening for my parents' footsteps. When I think they're close enough, I punch her. She always hits me back, but when she does, she gets caught. I, and I give her the good old victory wink. <laughs> wait a second. My sister helped me write this part of my performance. That means my parents know. This means war. Thank you, I'm Jared Arrington. <laughs>